Developing overnight, a plane hit and killed a person on Austin Bergstrom International Airport's runway. A whole lot of unanswered questions this morning, including what the person was doing on the runway to begin with. Candy Rodriguez is live for us at ABIA with the latest information about what she learned overnight. Good morning. Sally and Tom, good morning, and I don't expect to see a lot of folks making their way to Austin Bergstrom this morning amid the coronavirus pandemic, but for those who do need to fly, I can tell you maintenance crews have been working overnight to clear out and reopen the runway. I can tell you we're just an hour away from the first scheduled flight of the day's takeoff, but very little details are known this morning about last night's deadly runway crash. The crew of Southwest Airlines Flight 1392 reported to air traffic controllers they saw an unauthorized individual on the runway after landing last night a little after 8. Take a listen. Tower Southwest 1392, we believe there might be a person on the runway. An airport employee then found the victim dead on the runway overnight. The FAA, APD, and the Austin Aviation Department all investigated. In a statement from Southwest Airlines, officials say the pilot tried to move to avoid the person. They also report no one on the plane was hurt. Passengers on other flights that landed around the same time reacted to the news. It's just mind blowing when you're landing, you're not thinking about is there a person or I mean other vehicle really on the, the runway. Yeah. So uh, it's not something that crosses your mind. I mean, that could have been our plane. Who knows? And of course, we still have a lot of questions for those investigating that we hope to get answered later this morning. Like who was the victim? Who is this person? How were they even able to get on the runway? As you mentioned, Sally, and what exactly were they doing there? And of course, as soon as we get those details, we'll bring those to you on KXAN and KXAN.com. Live at Austin Bergstrom this morning, Candy Rodriguez, KXAN News. Yeah, Candy, thank you. I mean, the airports all over this country, they increased security after 9-11. And it's interesting to see how this could have happened. So I know we'll be checking in to that throughout the day. Appreciate you.